Okay, as I said, 30 seconds, but no, because you're coming here from part four. This is part five of uh, 18 holes around Sun City Country Club, where how I play golf. Every shot I'll explain, and hopefully by now you're well aware of that because you've already watched all the other ones. If you haven't, the whole series is up there. So if you saw that fifth, sorry, the fourth part, you'd see that I've got a little bit of work to do. Um, I'm, uh, I've got four holes, uh, sorry, three holes here, a par four, a three, and a five. I only get a shot on one of them, this first one. So I really need to make this one count if I'm gonna make some inroads. So if you do enjoy it while you're watching, smash that like button, leave me a comment, subscribe, and ring the bell for notifications. We'll see you on the uh, 13th tee very shortly. Okay, so 13th hole, I've got to think about this. It's a new day, even though it's not. Um, I'm only hitting a 7 iron here because there's a barranca that runs along at about 200 meters. I don't hit a 7 iron 200 meters, but it is wind behind and downhill heavily. And the last place I want to be is in there. And I do get a shot here. So hopefully this is just 7 iron wedge. Target line, I'm going left edge of that large tree. I kind of stayed straight, as long as it gets a good bounce. It's a bit shorter than I'd like, but it's running down. And uh, yeah, look, we'll have a bit more than a wedge. We'll maybe have an eight or a nine iron, but that's fine. All right, so I've got 155 meters to the center, but it is still downwind. I'm gonna hit an eight iron. Um, rather be short on this one anyway, so. just been tugged a little bit gone left Christ on a bike another bunker and that is not one to be in you talk about a bad miss that is it so when I say why this is such a bad miss look at that lump I've got to go over now and basically everything runs away from me from here if I try and go on the line direct to the flag I've got to land it basically at the flag hope it spins I can come out to the side here, which is probably most likely, and hope that I two putt. That's about all I've got. Not really sure where I'm going to put this. From here, that is a scary looking shot straight at the flag. I'll try going left of it, I suppose. It's a little less scary there, but it has to spin. I have to get it great, and I'm on the downhill lie. I think I'm just going to come out to this side. You might not get the best view of it, but I just think I've got to do that. Try and keep it on the green. Mind you, that way it's just as easy gonna run off. Do you know what, screw it. Let's have a go at it. Commitment, gonna have to hit this quite hard. Oh, that's about as good as I can hit that. Is it gonna stay on? Just. Woo! Okay, managed to just cling on the back here. Sort of like comes back up again here. That's the only thing that saved me, sort of see it kind of running around to the left a fair bit oh, got to pick a line see where I see it going into the hole all right there it is this is gonna go pretty quick come on let's cozy this one up Wow, that's... That's a wide. Tough going at the moment. I applaud you if you're hanging on through this because I don't even want to watch this right now. This could be the third double in as many holes. I need to show a little bit of metal make one of these putts. Wow. Okay. Well, three behind. It's going to be a 
big effort from here. Two holes in a row now where I do not get a shot. That's golf, isn't it? That is golf. Okay, hole 14, par three. Sitting on five points through four holes. Not good. Uh, it's um, 145, but downwind, hitting a nine. Pretty much straight at the flag, because it's dead behind. Maybe a touch to the right. go a bit. Oh no. Oh yeah. Oh, I think it's gone another bunker. What is that, like 73 bunkers I've been in today? Ladies and gentlemen, I was wrong. It's not in the bunker, but that's the shot I've got coming up. I'm gonna go and put you behind it. I don't really need to do anything special with this. Sort of, Life's not brilliant, but I mean, it's not terrible. Got loads of green. I can just run it up. I'm thinking of 50 degrees to be honest, about halfway. It won't spin a lot because of the rough I'm in here. But stay connected and get through the ball. Pick my landing spot. Let's hit it. A bit short of my landing spot, but it is. Oh, no. Ooh, wow. Hmm. I'm going to have to move that camera again. All right, I've got to perk myself up because you boys and girls are going to switch off if I keep being the miserable git that I'm being right now. So. Six feet, say. So. I did watch it the whole way. It was pretty straight. Maybe a tiny bit right to left. Come on. We've got nothing down yet. Knee bump. Massive push. Jeez. And this is for a point, so it's got to go. All right. It's another. Well, that one's a bogey. But uh, another one pointer, now four behind. While I walk to this, I will talk about handicaps for a second. Some of you might have seen a video I uh, did about my partnerships, recent partnerships, and one of those was with the Golf Collective where you can get handicapped for social rounds as well. And um, look, this isn't one today because I'm playing on my own, obviously. But I think the thing to understand with handicaps is that they are a reflection of your potential ability, not how you play every week. And it is very important to remember that when you're playing golf. Okay, par five, uh, uphill into wind. Three shots. Let's worry about hitting the fairway and anything else is a bonus. So I'm gonna be aiming at, there's two like white flag fence lamppost type things up there. I'll be aiming at the leftmost of those. a wee bit slicey but it's on the flipping fairway okay I have 266 meters playing 302 can't get there can I particularly as I, uh, I only just hit my drive 210 meters so let's split it up 265 I mean let's even say that it's two 150 shots um, or maybe take a little bit more than that. I'm going to hit. I'm going to hit five iron. Hopefully that can leave me about 130, 140 in, something like that. No, sorry, plays like that. Right, 
five iron, see your shot, hit it. So we are going uh, kind of about there. Just the left or right corner of that house. Wind's coming off that side or off the left hand side. So I have got a little bit of a draw lie though, so I'm gonna adjust a little bit for that actually. I'm gonna go maybe left edge of the big trees up there. Delighted with that, it's gone nowhere, but it's an amazing shot. Okay, so I have 123 meters left, and I'm gonna hit a seven iron, based on the fact that my five iron just went 150. Going uh, right edge of the, the wall, because it is pushing it that way a little bit as well. Just left it out there. Perfect distance. It's just 40 yards right. Comment below, how would you play this? It's a very, very tight lie. Got a slight upslope as you get to the green, and anything on the green runs away from you. Right, fifth shot, no strokes on this hole, so I need this to go in. Folks, sometimes golf is hard. It is not all rainbows and unicorns around these parts. 58 degree, about halfway. Settle. Right, uphill putt. Get out of here with a six. It will be another one pointer to finish the putt. Firm and straight, it's for a point anyway. No prizes from being short. They really are. Okay, that's the end of the part. So I, again, only managed three points through that part, but when you're playing like this, the only aim is two points per hole. Regardless of where you are, you've just gotta go and try and go two points per hole. So join me in the next video where I just try and get six points, quite simply, and uh, try and make some inroads back onto this. If you did enjoy this video, what's wrong with you? But thank you, comment below, subscribe, ring the bell. See you again in a second.